Now I'm going to hydraulic test the uh, demon boiler. Just um, put a bit of water in the header tank and uh, we'll see it come through. Operate the pump. There we go, all the air's gone now. Let's test the pump. I've never used this pump for uh, a hydraulic test, so um, a quick way to check it is to see if it'll uh, pump against that closed valve. Yeah, we're leaking. I'll just tighten the gland. Yeah, so if it's leaking from the gland, it'd probably be sucking air too and uh, not pumping properly. So uh, you can't afford to have any leaks with these. Oh, that's better. I can hardly push that now. Alright, let's fill the boiler and see if we can get her up to um, 120 pounds. I think it's nearly full. I didn't count how many went in, in it, but I reckon at least ten or a dozen. Wow, it's thirsty. Here it is. Fully spilled out. So there should be no air in it. Here's the pressure gauge. We'll just screw that on. It's not the proper one for it, it's the test gauge. So it'll read to uh, 150 psi. There she goes, going on. Get a better spanner. That's much better. Screw it in from the uh, adapter I made. Which is uh, 5 sixteenths ME on the boiler to quarter BSP for the gauge. No, one eighth BSP for the gauge. Alright, let's give her a few pumps and see what happens. There we go, guy just coming up. 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 100, 120, 150. It's leaking down through the through the hand pump, so I've stopped the uh, the stop valve. 
and the gauge is reading 140 psi. So uh, there's no leaks that I can see, and it's holding a steady reading. So I'd say she's fit for steam.